and how much does it cost? I de I determine it by how much it costs and my talent. For example, the materials used in this cost, for example, like five dollars. My talent is worth like ten dollars, so I combine both of those, which makes fifteen dollars. Welcome to Mundo Kids. My name is Alejandro Suarez, and today I'm with Silvana, that writes and illustrates. Um, how much years have you been in the United States? For four years. And how much years do you have? My age is currently nine years old, and I'm almost ten. What do you like? Writing more or illustrating? Illustrating. Why? Because I find it more relaxing because it just clears my mind, and when I draw, I just forget about everything. And what do you like for drawing? I, I like acrylic paints. I like brushes and watercolors. Can you hand me the the paintings like that? I can see the picture. Thank you. No problem. Actually, this one feels a lot textured. Yeah, because it, it has this technique called 3D paint. And can you tell me a, a little bit about 3D paint? It's like normal paint. It's just that it's 3D. So when you put it with a side profile, it looks like there's actually real dots in it. Yeah, it's like textury. Yeah, a lot textury. And can you talk to me about this one? That one is the Mona Lisa, and I made it my version. It's not completely like the original version. Yeah. But I made a version, the version like if she's the queen of gold. Yeah, I like how you did that. But yeah, it also has a bit of that technique in it. The little necklace. Yeah. Here you go. Thank you. Can you talk about, about the other one? This one is a 3D paint one. I think it's okay. It has this technique called 3D paint. It's if you put it from a side profile, you can see that it has some dots. It takes a lot of time to dry up though, but it's a very cool technique because when you touch it, it feels like there's dots all over Is it. Is that a rainbow tunnel? Yes. Okay. I dream about this every single night. I dream about rainbows. And how do you sell them? Um, I put them in these like, arch thingies and I put them in this way so people can see it and touch it and maybe they'll think about buying it. And how much does it cost? I, de I determine it by how much it costs and my talent. For example, the materials used in this cost, for example, like $5. My talent is worth like $10. So I combine both of those which makes fifteen dollars. Yeah. How much does it take to do that one? This one is since a used 3D paint. And you can see you can see some of the sketch here. Yeah. Um I had to sketch it out because sometimes when I do my drawings, I don't really know how it's gonna turn it out. So first I do it on paper normal paper, then I transfer it to the canvas, which ends up like this, and then I paint it. Wait, do you do that with pencil or something else, like a sharpie? Like, I put it with pencil. Okay. I first draw it out on pencil, then I use like all the rainbow colors, and then I started to draw it in. Okay. And then, that's when I added the texture, and then I put my sign and my sticker. And how much does that one take? Oh, this one? Yeah. Well, this one takes like one hour. Okay. So, as you can see, it's not underlined with any type of pencil, etc. I use black paint with a thin pencil. I then started to sketch it out and then that's when I added the accessories. Do you do another size like bigger than that one? This is my biggest size and this is like the smallest one. Okay. But I am planning in the future having a much bigger size. Do you do only only illustrations that you want to do? Um, I do make custom paintings for only my friends, like at school or something. But I do make sure to to kind of like 
tell them to pay me like at least one dollar, two dollars, because it won't be fair if I just give them to free and if yeah. and they don't give me something back. So Bana, we're about to say goodbye. Do you have something to tell the kids? Yes. I want to tell y'all that that you can always follow your dreams like I did and how I became an artist and how I created these amazing paintings. Thank you, Shivana, for coming. Thank you and for inviting me here. I'm Alejandra and see you in the next one.